Spoiler alert. Spoiler. Make sure you watch the episode before watching this video because we will be giving details of the show. So make sure you watch the episode first. Hi, y'all. I'm Ivy. And I'm Yak. And welcome to another episode of Show Realm. In today's episode, we're going to be discussing season five of the hit series Snowfall. First time I met you, I said to myself, this young man has the war inside. Franklin, we're glad you got your own dreams. But they're not ours. Swear to me, you will do everything you have to do to protect our baby. I promise. We're actually going to be switching it up. Instead of doing a recap, we're going to do a new segment that we like to call Couple Thoughts. And we're just going to be answering a couple questions about the show. But before we get started, grab your snacks, grab your drinks, and relax your body. Clear your mind. Open your soul. Forget everything you got going on at home, at work. Oh, that. Yeah, and come vibe with us. Welcome to our room. y'all now that we're all pulled up let's get started before we get into our couple thoughts about episode one i just want to give you a little background about the series snowfall so snowfall follows the crack cocaine epidemic that happened in los angeles back in the 1980s so it touches on police brutality media influence and basically everything that surrounds that so what I like about it is that it goes into the corruption and basically everything that happened around the start of the cocaine epidemic. So coming back into season five, episode one, um, season four ended pretty. I I once I guess the line was drawn like between a lot of relationships. People wanted to go their own way. People wanted out but couldn't get out. You know, a chapter was closed between Franklin. And I can't even think of a girl name, you know, from what happened. And so, started this episode, basically, Franklin's, you know, living a new life. You know, his mother and father left in the old episode because, you know, based on everything that he was doing. And his father ended up getting popped because he was running his mouth a little bit too much. So, Bam! snowfall we've been waiting for this this is the one that we like okay when is it coming back we found out it was coming back and we was like oh yeah it's time so like she said we're about to change it up a little bit this ain't gonna be your standard recap this gonna be more of your we got three key questions and then we kind of wrap it up it's kind of quick to the point but they important questions and they important insight as to what's going on. So the first question we have is, what was our favorite moment of the show? So before we get into this, of course, make sure y'all watch the show because we will be, you know, diving into the show a little bit to answer these questions. So I would like to say that my favorite moment about the show was when I saw that Wanda was still clean. So y'all, y'all should know the history about Wanda, how she ended up. You know, being on drugs really bad. And that was really hard to see because, you know, she seemed like a really sweet person. But she was just hooked on drugs really bad. And she finally got clean. And they had moments where I felt like she was going to relapse. I'm like, oh, no, like, this is going to be it. But luckily, it was nice to see that, you know, in the beginning of this episode, in the beginning of this episode for this season, that she was still clean and going strong and, you know, trying to find work and you know, well, trying to work this crazy job that she was working at. So, I feel like that was a top moment for me. That's definitely a good one if you want the old tearjerker one. You know, I like Snowfall. I like Snowfall for his gangster feel and all that. So, my favorite part is when Leon bashed the dude's oh, ankles yeah. in for stealing from him. I thought that was key. I like to see. Because, you know, sometimes in the past season, Leon kind of been a little not able to 
Leon. You show. Because Leon was the one. Leon had to pop for Franklin before Franklin started popping. Yeah, he was the know? gunner. You right. You right. He was the gunner. But did he, he did have moments when he could get a little. I think it all changed when he accidentally killed that kid. Yeah. In the last season. That changed his outlook on a lot of things. So I think that probably toned him down like a lot. Because that was like a rule they had. Like no kids basically. So. Yeah, so that was definitely our moments. So coming off of that, that leads me to the second thought. That's going to be the biggest threat. And I feel like the biggest threat was leading in off of that last thing that I just said about him bashing Um, his ankles in. He should have just knocked them off. Oh, okay. Yeah, I mean, because we've seen this happen earlier seasons Mm -hmm. where... Okay, you give one, and then you seen him later on in the episode. He was kind of looking him down, staring at him. Yeah, so you feel like later on he could possibly want to retaliate, basically. Oh, yeah, he could definitely become a problem. Yeah, I could see that, but I also could see why they kept him alive. It was like a walking reminder to let people know, don't steal nothing from me, because they messed his feet up. The best reminder is for you to... Oh, yes. So, my biggest threat in this episode, it could be a little controversial, you know, but I feel like in this line of work, this could definitely be, like, a hindrance. And that is his girl slash his little family that he's trying to start. So, I don't even know where this girl came from. I, <laughs> she just popped up in this season, and I'm like, who is this? So, he seems happy, though, but it's just the fact that in this line of work, you know, it seems like she want him to kind of find a way out or to make it safe, you know, for him because, you know, they're having a child. So I feel like that's a threat because, for one, I don't know. I don't know her true intentions. Like I said, she just popped up in this season, and she knows a lot of stuff. You know what I'm saying? Like, she knows what he's doing. So and you feel like the threat is the family, or do you feel like the threat is her all together. I feel like it's her all together. I agree with you. I mean, I can't really even debate on that. I agree with you. I think I'm sitting there looking at him like, oh, you're mixing this family and business yeah, or this and pleasure like, and business. And yeah. I ain't liking that. So I agree with you on that. Yeah, and I know it sucks because, like I say, he seems happy, but at the same time, she, like, what happened? Like, she came into this business, and, like I said, I don't even know who she is, so it's just, like, I don't know. It seems like she could, I feel like she's going to be getting in the way in, in the future. She could either be getting in the way. She might actually become a liability, you know what I'm saying? Because now that she's pregnant and, you know, they're having a child and stuff, it's just, like, she gonna do what's best for her child, you know, so. Might make a little soft on them, too. And then it also gives, like, people something to go after. Like, before it was this mom and dad. He got them out the way. So nobody can use that against him. Got but now it's gonna be his to girl. Him. Exactly. So they wanna get to him. I'm gonna go through his girl to get to him. You know what I'm saying? So. I think that's a great threat. Great. So actually, that kind of ties into the next question that we have, which is, what is the biggest mistake that we've seen in this episode? And I would like to say the biggest mistake is him trying to start a family. And I say that because he know, like, he's trying to get out of this game, but at the same time, he know that I don't. I feel like he knows that he's not getting out anytime soon. So you think he's lying to himself? So I do feel like he's lying to himself in a way, but maybe he's just trying to be hopeful, you know? Yeah, it makes sense. So that's what I'm saying. They starting a family now, and we don't know when he's going to get out of this game. So I feel like, like I said before, this could really, this is like a mistake because he could be putting people's lives, like, in danger, you know? That's a good one. That was a good one. I mean, I feel like, like we spoke on the last one, I feel like that could definitely lead to some problems down the line. So, I'm in I'm in agreement on that one. Mm-hmm. So, what's your mistake? My mistake. A lot of people probably gonna look at me and be like, "Yeah, you crazy," but I don't know. I just be peeping a lot of things, and I feel like I don't know if he's peeping it, but peaches, 
Peaches talking about he got a head cold and yeah. he reaching for his nose and he just seemed off this he season. He did seem a little off, yeah. He's he just he just out the way on this one. I feel like Franklin ain't aware. Or if he is, I know he got a lot going I think on he right is, now. So kind of looked at him. He was like, "Like you good?" And he was like, "Oh, it's just a cold." And he just kind of glanced. So maybe he like don't want to think like that, you know? Because that's like his right hand man. Like, right, that's definitely his right him, hand. You know, so maybe he just don't want to think like that. So, but we'll see if that pans out. Yeah. So that brings us to our last thought. How did we feel about the episode as a whole? I liked it. I liked that they basically kind of showed what's going on, where everybody stands at. It kind of um, kept your eyes open. I'm I'm ready to see more. Yeah, I feel the same way. Like I feel like it was kind of like giving us like a, a review of like like he said how everybody is doing, kind of like. You know, we saw, you know, the evolution of Franklin. He got a family now. We see Leon still in the apartments, like, getting stuff popping. We seen a couple, you know, his aunt and uncle. So we got a real glimpse of what everybody's doing. They kind of set some, you know, planted some seeds about what we could kind of expect, you know, in the future a little bit. Just kind of, you know, get our mind wondering. It's definitely a good first episode to kind of get us started. Yeah, definitely. All right, y'all. So that's all we have for this video. Leave y'all answers to our questions down in the comments below. Like, subscribe, and yeah, come back and get this fire content.